drank it? No, not yet. Oh, okay. I thought I was like. I'm making sure some oil and stuff's circulating. Good to have oil in. Dusty, you ready? I am ready. I'm glad to hear it. I'm ready too. I'm ready for that sun to go down and cool off. That'd be a blessing. Ed, you ready? I'm ready, man. All right. We're going to do it. We are at Cochran Motor Speedway in Cochran, Georgia tonight. Racing with the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series. This is round four out of, I think we have, with some rain outs that happened, I think we still got 18, 19 on the schedule. So round four out of 18 or 19, Joseph is tied with Will Harrington, number 19. Can't really see him from here. This is Will's home track, but him and Joseph are tied in the points lead, going into round four. Ten thousand dollars to win tonight at Cochran Motor Speedway. This is Joseph's fourth trip to Cochran, and I think our second time running a super late model here. There is Cochran Motor Speedway. It's been hot and dry here in Georgia, kind of the opposite of what we've been dealing with early in the year. So I don't think track shouldn't be too rough tonight, but I know they're going to be doing all they can. To keep some moisture in it and keep it racy all night long so when we leave here we are headed to eldora speedway for the dirt late model dream three nights of racing thursday friday and saturday so we got to get through tonight and then we can get to ohio put our new wrap on that will be debuting here soon that goes along with kind of windy ain't it goes along with our roof i was just telling them i'm excited about uh a wrap for eldora anyway that's coming up next week at Eldora. We gotta get through tonight and get a good run in here at Cochran before we can move on to Ohio. What about you, you ready? Oh yeah. You excited? You sound excited. Pumped up, baby. So Jesse wasn't here. Joseph had to drive the whole way here all night. What time we get here? 5.15 a.m. 5.15, but then you got to sleep all day. Yeah, I didn't get out of bed till it was one o'clock, I think, the time <laughs> I come outside. So I'm not mad about it, we're good. But just kind of getting on that, in. kind of getting on that schedule because they're gonna be right. a bunch of late, late nights, nights driving, going mm -hmm. everywhere. So, kind of going the next couple weeks is gonna be nice to be on that uh, up until daylight type of thing. <laughs> yeah, so well, up late anyway. I don't know about yeah. daylight because I sure didn't make it to daylight. I'm more like a 12 p.m. to 5 a.m. type of schedule there. Same philosophy as last time. Just go out there and do what you can and try to win the race and. Check out where we shake out. You got a better idea? Nope. That's right, well. kind of what I figured you were planning on doing. <laughs> See. Get a good run in, get out of here, and then go to Ohio. And Jesse's butt better be there come whatever day that is. Yeah. Wednesday. Either he, better, <laughs> or either he better be there or have another job when we get back. <laughs> <laughs> no, we, uh, Jesse, we all took off last weekend. Uh, me, Joseph, Jordan, and Dusty, we all got last weekend off. Jesse raced in Michigan last weekend. Hope y'all watch those videos. So he got this weekend off and he will be meeting us in Ohio. Top of the charts in the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series Tour this year, the Langenfelder Mechanical Base Race Fuels 10 car. It's Milton, Florida's Joseph Joyner. Joseph Joyner, the Hunt the Front car in car number 10.
number 10. Has uh, been impressive every race we've run this season. His worst finish of the year came in a race that he led six laps of, or rather not six laps, he led 22 laps at Alltech. It's uh, Joseph Joyner who finished 11th after fading late in the race. Joyner then went on to finish second at Magnolia and finished third at Swainsboro and has found himself tied with Harrington. Bo Slay in the two car there on your screen. He's in a little lower line than some of the other drivers in turn one and two. Play nine on your screen in 42. Joyner has turned the fastest lap of hot laps as the checkered flag begins to fly here on the third group. Well, that looked pretty good. Joseph is fastest, fastest so far, 14-1-1-2. One more group to go and Joseph's the fastest out of the first three. First time we've been fastest in third draft hot laps. <laughs> End of the year, whoever has the most uh, quick oh, times at hot laps gets uh, a bonus from dirt draft. I don't remember what it is, but first time all year Joseph has been fastest in dirt draft hot laps for the Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series. I don't think y'all could hear him, but what he said right there is he thinks we need to pull some gear out. Gear change? Yeah, make a little gear swap. Feel good? Same RPM, everything. Begin with the straightaway as it is at the end. Everything else feel good? You look good. Yeah. Dang good. Yeah. Just gotta qualify up there. Mm -hmm. So we'll qualify, heat race, top four, five, something like that. Five and the heat. Five and top five in the heat. And then well, how, long, how many laps is the feature tonight? 50, 50 laps. We're gonna need a hard tire. There is the qualifying lineup. Joseph is the fifth car out, out of 13 in group two. 27 cars tonight, Joseph's in group two. We'll go out fifth for qualifying. That'll decide where he starts a heat race. Four heats tonight, taking the top five, and then a B main, one B main taking two. Four, uh, 50 lap, 10,000 to win main event. George Stubb, he don't need no gloves. I don't need no gloves. In the Langenfelder Mechanical Contractors Base Race Fuel, trading paint, J. Dickens powered Longhorn chassis out of Milton, Florida. It's Hunt the Front, Joseph Joyner in car number 10, and the Croft Heating and Air Carrier, Westmoreland Trucking Clements Powered Capital, Woodstock, Georgia. Car number nine is Jason Croft. Jason Croft in car number nine. Joyner's first lap is good enough for third quick. Henderson goes to fourth quick. Croft goes to fifth quick. Lap number two for John Henderson. He takes the checkered flag. He'll stay fourth fastest, see what Joyner can do. Joyner tied for the points lead coming into tonight's event, stays third fastest, so Bo Slay, again, looks like you want to go early. Bo Slay in the first group is the fastest out of the first six cars that have qualified here in Group B. Well, dang. And group your fifth and group two, you'll start third and eat three. What to do? Uh, it's kind of tight across the center. Good. I guess maybe I maybe I was kind of running too too hard up in there. Yeah. Combination of the two. Yeah, I think you had to be in the bottom, like the whole way. 
Okay, quick turnaround. Joseph is going off third in heat three, eight laps. Top five transfer to the main event. Winner goes to the redraw. still have the two and the four available in the Jericho Transmissions redraw. Michael Page, Play Knight, side by side. Green flag is in the air, Page fired. Got the jump, Play Knight's gonna fight to the bottom. He'll cut in front of Joseph Joyner, that battle to turn one. Knight washes up the racetrack. He had a push in that car, and Joyner right back around. Knight nearly opened the door for Henderson, who snuck in. They are battling like crazy there for the fourth to fifth positions as Brendan Smith and Jeremy Pickett. to hold off Joseph Joyner, Clay Knight, and John Henderson and Jeremy Payton in top five the way they run. They'll battle through turn one and two, and down the back straight away, single file out, does your top five. Joyner takes a peek on the top. He may just be seeing what it's got. Michael Page is going to win heat race number three. Joseph Joyner, Clay Knight, John Henderson. All right, second place finish in heat three should put a start. Sixth, I believe. Mo is right here on board. Racing to get in the redraw here. We'll see what Mo does. Race number four, Bo Slay fires, green flag is in the air, and he gets a really good jump off this Josh Tuttle. Boy, Ryan Crane did not get a good start. He falls all the way back to third, and the door is open for Croft as we've got a battle for the lead up front. Putnam in the 212. He's not satisfied with second. He's putting pressure on Bo Slay, who leads lap number one. Slay, Putnam, Crane, Croft, and Carter, your top five. Carter up the racetrack. That'll allow Bryant to sneak under. Bryant now in the fifth position, but Carter battles back on the outside. They're door to door in turn three. Carter has got a lot of laps around the Cocker Motor Speedway. And see what he can do. And Bryant Double is in the tier for at home as the cross flags go up in the air. Halfway down, halfway done. Battle for the lead on the left hand side of your screen. Putnam to the inside of Bo Slay. He'll muscle by, and Josh Putnam, your race leader, off of turn two. Of your race leader or of your second running and pole starting, Bo Slay with the white flag in the air. Last chance for Bryant as he puts the muscle to Henry Carter and makes the pass stick. So Carter now falls back as heat race number four. Checkered flag is out. Josh Putnam, your winner. Bo Slay second, Ryan Crane third. All right, Bo led a few laps there, ends up second. So he'll start one spot behind, one row behind Joseph in eight. Joseph starts sixth. Bo and eight. Harrington's on pole, the, our co-points leader. So we got to make up some spots and get to him in the main event. Still lacking a little bit. Yeah, I got this, this tied across the center, and I can't just roll around, you know, roll yeah, around. It's a little stub, huh? How are we on times, like, compared to, I know Page. Yeah. passes Page, and I think Putnam was faster. Yeah. Oh, dang. We got
got to figure something out to go forward from where we are, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Winger and Putnam. Putnam is third in points. He just won Bo's heat there, heat four, and drew. He's just starting on the second row, third or fourth somewhere. Right, right ahead of Joseph. Good run, Bo. You'll be starting right behind Joseph. Y'all can go to the front. <laughs> Let's go. There's the horn. All right. Now we're ready. All right, here we go. Main event time. 50 laps, $10,000 on the line. Need to make up some spots. Get toward the front of this thing. We'll see what happens. Three and four, it's time to hunt the front at Cochrane Motor Speedway. Green flag is in the air and we're underway. The race to turn one, all important as they roll through. Harrington with the advantage, but here comes Michael Page on the outside. tied to, at the top of the charts. They're battling for the second spot in turn one. Jordan's on the outside. Now Harrington moves up the racetrack, as does Winger. These guys have figured out that the top line has some momentum, especially early here at Water Help there in the intermission period. And we've got a sporty racetrack here at the battlefield. Putnam, Joyner, Harrington, and Winger. What a field. Oh, got one around off of turn four in front of your leaders. Caution flag will fly. Green flag is back out. We are back underway. Battle for second. Harrington for the advantage. He'll dive to the bottom of Putnam for the race lead. Slide up in front of Putnam. Putnam has to get on the binders. Harrington, your leader. What a move. A little aggressive. See if Putnam tries to repay the favor. Don't look now, but here comes Michael Page and Ashton Winger. Winger had to get hard on the binders on the bottom. It allowed both Joyner and Page to sneak back by on the outside. Side by side for third, Page on the top, Joyner on the bottom. Now three wide for the fourth spot. Up the racetrack to the middle of the racetrack goes Winger and back by goes Trey Mill. Battle for third though, Joyner under side of Michael Page. It's right here front and center on your screen. Joyner slides up across the nose of the 18X, crossover from Page, and they're back down the front straight away with Joyner leading Michael Page for third. Will Harrington, your race leader, is in lap traffic. He's got Putnam as the yellow flag fly. 36 laps remaining. Up the racetrack goes Putnam. He'll get the momentum wound up. I think he went way too high as he gets a challenge from Michael Page on the inside. So three wide now for third. Trey's up the racetrack into Michael Page. Michael is able to stay off of Josh, and they'll race back. No harm, no foul through turn three and four. Move Trey Mills momentarily. In the third, and whoa, man, oh, man, everybody bouncing off of each other as they race into turn one. One car goes around. Oh, man, oh, man, caution flag. Garrett Smith goes around back to green. Off the racetrack goes Trey Mill. Corner slides up. He'll take second. Has second coming off the corner. Three wide back for the fourth. Has third. Now Pearson Lee Williams is in fourth, and he is on the move. The Dublin, Dublin Georgia driver for the win. Motorsports win land development. Oh, off the racetrack goes Joyner. Up and over the berm. He stays in the gas to keep us green. And down the back straightaway, he'll lose a ton of positions. He'll fall in line somewhere around about 16th 
And up front, we stay green. Harrington, Putnam, and Pearson Lee Williams, your top three. Caution flag is out as one car is around off of turn four. up the racetrack, opens the door for Putnam. They're door to door. A little contact. I'm telling you, there is no love loss between the top two. Halfway done in this 50 lap feature event. Cross flag from Will Banks to the Cochran Motors Freeway flag. And Pete Freeman going to battle underneath Michael Page down the back straight away. So Freeman trying to get back up in the mix. Started 13th. Had some early troubles and a car around in turn three. position. He's back up in the top four now. Three, three, and four, and off of turn number four, there is your leader, Will Harrington. Josh Putnam, Dalton Cook, Joseph Joyner, the top four. Joyner's closing the gap there on Cook. He is. He is indeed. Joyner looks to the inside of Dalton. the door for Joyner. Joyner peeks it in there side by side. Cook with two laps back. remaining. He was your fast qualifier. He won heat race number one. He redrew the pole position. He leads the field through turn three and four out of turn number four. White flag is in the air. One more lap remaining. Battle is for third. We got a car slow. He'll get out of the way there over the top of turn number two. We're going to race back to the checkers through turn three and four. Off of four, he hunt the front here at his home racetrack. Found the front, did Will Harrington here at Cochran. He wins the 10,000 to win feature event. Second to Josh Putnam, Dalton Cook third, Joseph Joyner fourth, and John Henderson. Well, got a fourth. Fourth place finish, all things considered. I think we'll settle for a fourth and be happy with it. Could have been a lot worse. Oh. Well, that could have been a lot worse. Yeah. <laughs> Salvage it anyway. Hey, yeah, salvaged yeah. the fourth. We'll take that, all things considered. Anything last two hours or what? Golly. Yeah, Seems I'm like thirsty. you've been in there a while. I'm thirsty. I know yeah, yeah, go get him on the Tell us. Everybody knows how to drive a race car and they're good at it. I messed up, drove off the racetrack. But if you look at this race car, the only damage on it is from when somebody right rear me in the left front on a restart. Like they come up. Yeah. I ain't hit nobody. I come from what, 14th? Yep. The fourth. The fourth. Sixth, the second. Everybody else just goes, they, they, they run over each other. Yeah, like, they, they just run over each other. And had like, 20 causes. I mean, I don't know what, like this. <laughs> It's aggravating. I oh, thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. <laughs> um, it is. It's, it, it, it worked out that everybody does that, you know, fighting for that rubber. But like, 
it just it, it's it's kind of you know like a lot of these guys are really good at what they do but they get out there and like literally take off and just run don't matter where if there's a car there or not they just, they just go, go there. there i know and then, believe me i was standing there frustrated too so it worked out for us you know yeah. it, you know caused a lot of cars to be able to uh for us to be able to get back up right. there so well hey good job fourth place harrington won so Good points tonight for him, but we didn't fall too, fall too far back. Yeah. Still second. So far, our worst finish we gonna drop is 11th. So right. we can keep it. We can, we can keep top fives other than that. That's all you can ask for. All right. We go to Eldora now. We can head yeah. to Ohio. I don't think we really hurt anything. Everything should be fine. So uh, everything should be good. We're good all to right. go. Hey, good job. I guess we're gonna go ahead and pull those off. Good spares. If anybody needs. Hey, some yeah, anybody needs some good rubber? We got it. <laughs> That'll do it from Cochran. We're headed to Ohio. Got it up and got the Georgia clay off of it. So we can go to Ohio to Eldora and we'll put the rest of the American Dream, chasing the American Dream wrap on. Three, two, one. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Woo, good job. Thank y'all.